what's up? My name is Techno, here for Troubleshoot, and welcome back to another video. So recently, Battlefield 2042 released an update, and instead of fixing the game for lots of people, it actually broke it quite a bit more. If you updated the game in the past few days, and for some reason you have a black screen whenever you're launching the game, loading into a map, etc, etc, this video should help you solve that, especially if you're using EA Desktop to launch the game. If you're not using EA Desktop to launch the game or Origin, this video may still help you, though tips will be very different for your platform of choice. Now, I don't own the game on Origin, but you can get it through EA Play Pro or of course a trial through EA Play. They both have this issue. Simply said, if you're using the brand new EA desktop launcher, such as suggested over here to play the game, you may be receiving a black screen when you're trying to play the actual game itself. But all you have to do to fix it is to download and install the old Origin launcher, to which you can find a link in the description down below. If you haven't already got it installed on your computer, close out of EA Desktop entirely, as in close the window, then open up Task Manager and make sure all EA and Origin processes are completely closed, and then fire up Origin. Inside of Origin here, when you've logged in, all of the games should still be installed on your computer. You don't have to install them again. It'll just pick them up from all the directories where they're supposed to be. Then all you have to do is launch up the game and things should work properly through Origin instead of EA Desktop. Now, of course, this may not work for you, in which case, either way, you need to get into the Origin launcher as such, not EA Desktop. Then right click Battlefield and simply click Repair. Or if you see an update button, you can click that too. This will then force the game to update through the Origin Launcher instead of EA Desktop and is likely to solve your issue. This has solved the issue for most people. However, if you're still experiencing issues, the last solution that I've heard of working and seems to have a pretty high success rate, although it's one of the most unfavorable options, is to actually uninstall the game and then re-download the game from scratch using the Origin Launcher, not EA Desktop. I'm not too sure what could be causing this or why, but this seems to be the solution for most people in regards to the latest update that caused the black screen issue. In future, I may release another black screen fix guide if there's anything else that causes it rather than this particular update here around the 18th, 19th of November, 2021. But anyways, that's about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.